Hail Internet, I am Lord Vikingbeard and welcome to Tailwind. This is a humble original game. Um, you literally can't get it anywhere other than Humble Bundle. I think you can't even get it anywhere outside of uh, the Humble Monthly. So even if you went to the website right now, I had a quick look myself and I couldn't find it anywhere to buy. So at least as of now, only Humble Monthly players can play it. Which I think is a bit silly if it's any good, but we're going to find out if it's any good. Um, one assumes there may be some idea to release it on Humble Platform itself. But we're going to have a look at it and see what it is. Um, it looks interesting, I like the art style already. Uh, we'll start with the tutorial and find out what the fuck's going on. Right, aim and paint. Okay, hold. Oh god, okay, I have... Wait, does it... Does it constantly fire? That's a... Okay, that's a teleport, right. WASD move. That, teleport. That. Some kind of... Super teleport! Release. Like, is this... Is this all the tutorial is? Okay, I think I've already had enough of that. Well, fuck it, let's see what... Play this shit! It's... So I need to have one of those in order to do anything. Right. Oh, I just blew myself up. Excellent. I don't get it. Okay, what am I doing? How do I press space? Fuck me. That's not clear. That should be clearer. It's almost the same fucking color. Okay. Uh. Uh. I'm not sure I truly understand any of what's going on. Oh, I'm done, am I? Um... I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I li I have absolutely no idea what I'm supposed to do. Let's have another look at that tutorial, shall we? I'm... I'm already slightly annoyed, let's be fair. Right. Hold. Aim. And paint. Okay. Right. Am I supposed to just teleport around and then do that? It's, it's still not clear. In any stretch of the by any stretch of the imagination, and that's not good. That's not a fun way to make a game. It's an annoying way to make a game. So I can move about. These guys are trying to shoot me. I imagine that those rocks hurt me. Um, I'm already fucking dead, which is just brilliant. Fuck's sake. Um, so far, can't say I'm super impressed. Okay, where's that painting mechanic come in, for fuck's sake? Oh wow, that's a lot of them. It's also hard to have any idea where you're going to fucking turn up. Hmm... Um, yeah, I'm not digging this. I'm, I'm actually finding this an incredibly frustrating experience. Not only is it nigh on impossible to tell what the fuck you are doing, and it ridiculously easy to fucking die. No wonder this is in Humble Originals. Oh, we've got this game and it's really fucking annoying to play. It's... 
got a ridiculously obtuse control system. <laughs> and no cunt's going to buy it. I certainly fucking wouldn't. If I played this as a demo, I'd be like, right, this isn't for me. Uh, I wanted to like it. I mean, I'm sure it's fun to watch. Maybe it's fun to watch. I mean, if you can tell what the fuck's going on. Uh, I'm not impressed. Um, fortunately, <laughs> it doesn't take much to impress me. You know, make your game fun. Make it work. In semi-intuitive. There's just many other ways to make games that are not fucking broken. And I don't know what killed me then. Was it one of the rocks? Was it one of the ships? I don't fucking know. If all this shit wasn't going past the screen at a million miles an hour, that would help. So, I think I'm doing right by flying through the, the other ships. I think. I'm given no context for this. People will say, oh, oh well, you learn by playing, you learn by playing. But, I'm not learning anything at the moment. I'm just learning that someone doesn't know how to make uncluttered visual design. I, I don't know what to say. Um, it's certainly different. <laughs> the most sort of damning with, um, what is it? Damning with faint praise. Oh, fuck off. Yeah, um, I'm going to have to say... Uh, <sighs> I'm not surprised that's in Humble Originals only. The visuals are fucking cool, um, and I really like them, but not during gameplay I don't, because I can't fucking tell what I'm doing. Ah, <sighs> that's really depressing, because um, I was under the impression that these would be, <laughs> it literally says, interesting and fun to play. That wasn't fun to play, that was fucking annoying to play. Um, <laughs> I can't say I'm impressed. Um, if anything, it might have been playable if the, it wasn't so visually cluttered. They've just stuck as much stuff on the screen at the same time as possible, and it makes it hard to tell what you're doing. Chuck in some obtuse controls with that, and it's just not fun. Maybe if I spent five hours playing it and I get good, but I don't want to do that. And um, I don't think a lot of people would want to do that. Especially for something that is exists for its own sake. Um, yeah, the music's good too. I'm just listening to it now while I'm talking. I mean, it's very epic and over the top, but yeah. I'm glad that you can't get this. Because I cannot recommend it. At all. <laughs> Maybe I'm an idiot, but I didn't like it. Um, yeah, so I think I'll call it there. Thanks for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. I was waiting to die to show you what annoyed me about the game, but um, there's potential that that might not happen. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Got myself killed rather quickly. Nice. Okay. The biggest problem I have with this game is this simple one. Right. This isn't so bad. It's a short walk. But some of the walks were ridiculous. It was absurd. You had to walk probably at least a couple of minutes. And it became really, really frustrating. Especially with how easily and how often you die. This one is definitely one of the more... Holy shit, I can't believe I got that. 